Hi guys, it's me, Rusty78609 in a cold RV in Central Texas, USA. It is, well, let's find out. Hey Google, what time is it? 7.36. Hey Google, good morning. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Rusty. The time is 7.36 a.m. Right now in Burnett, it's 44 and clear. Today, it'll be sunny with a forecasted high of 85 and a low of 54. Have a great day. You too, dude. <clears throat> hey, Google. Tell me a joke. One joke. Coming up, what kind of music do bunnies like best? Hip hop. <laughs> oh, that's too crazy. Anyway, I'm here in my little nest in Central Texas, my 16 cfb clipper cadet 16 foot rv that i live in full time now this is my fifth day guys already believe it or don't i'm telling you it's amazing <clears throat> but so far it is a perfect little nest for me i'm getting it all organized i've ordered a few little things from amazon to organize it a little more not i'll show you when i get them and uh, it's coming together really nicely for me slowly well i mean i'm 72 years old and all, I, let me tell you i was well i'll do a video about it later but anyway I, I, <laughs> you know when you come up with these ideas to oh hell i'll just buy a smaller rv well that's wonderful then you got to move crap a from your other rv into the you know the new one and that turns out to be a job guys i have to tell you and then you got to get organized it's new everything's in a different place i mean i keep leaning to the left to open the refrigerator door and it ain't there it's over here so anyway <clears throat> having said that uh what else uh time weather everything's cool got a joke done so and, and that's another thing the little google speaker worked out perfect this is going to be my tv right here my little chromebook and uh, we're going to take the other TV back today because that's with tax and everything. That's a hundred bucks coming home. That'll help pay for some other stuff. And I watched a couple of movies on this thing yesterday. It's fine and it's also rechargeable. It doesn't, you know, it's really easy peasy and I don't watch much TV anyway. And TV is not an important part of my life at all. So that's why I do that. And I know I'll probably get some feedback on that. But anyway, <clears throat> where am I here now? I punched the button. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Uh, there you go and I'll start here I'm not sure if this, this is 15 hours ago it says Dennis M good morning my Rusty I just thought what if you unleveled puff just enough to make the shower pan level <clears throat> yeah I had a little leak <clears throat> well not leak it was running down the edge of the shower thing because it's just a little, it, it's not a tub it's just a shower and it was dripping on the floor uh, yeah I could do that but that wouldn't be a permanent solution and I don't want to be fooling with it when I'm camping so I made me a permanent solution but anyway yeah using the, the silicone stuff and it works says so uh, uh, here's another one this is uh, Angie H where can one buy a CF 18 freezer cooler chest and what price range would it range would this be <clears throat> you can get a Dometic CF 18 at Amazon for about 400 bucks in that range they they vary a little depending on availability and if you know if, it, if that's not but you can get a bigger one you can get you can get some more different there's different sizes uh, this is angie h again what do you like to do on your downtime what type genre of books do you read i am stacking my kindle already with books for the future i am a big city girl berlin germany well how are you berlin germany and can hardly wait thanks rusty for all these videos they are a great help well i'm i'm glad i mean i'm surprised but anyway angie in berlin germany let me say this uh, the books i read you may not enjoy but i'll tell you what they are uh, i read uh, balzac he's a french writer i read uh, malpossant uh, somerset Maugham is a great writer uh, I, st I do like mark twain some people don't i do like mark twain some of his stuff is good uh, what else? Uh, I don't know. Uh, 
James Michener uh, wrote some books that are interesting. They're historical fiction. Uh, he wrote one about Poland uh, that was very interesting, one about Spain. Uh, and yeah, you might try Michener since you're in the, over in that area. You know, you, there's a lot of books on countries in, in that area done by James Michener. And that's about it. I mean, and it says, what do you like to do on your downtime? Uh, nothing is good. I, I enjoy doing nothing. <laughs> You know, but, you know, doing nothing is something. I mean, I know that sounds kind of weird, but doing nothing is something. You know, relaxing and enjoying a sunset is something. And, uh, but anyway, enjoy your, your life over there in Berlin and say hi to all my Berlin friends. You know, I'm an old German Jew. I, I didn't realize it, but I am. <clears throat> Yet my, one side of my family is. Now, the other side, Shaw, I think that's German too, come think about it. Uh, PJ Bikerful left a link to the Coachman Clipper Cadet. Thank you. This is Grandma Patty. Uh, comment called David is the life of the party and laughter will keep us all young. That's a fact. La when all else fails, laugh. Even if you feel like you're going to cry, laugh. Uh, Rhonda says fix your Amazon link. Here is tube help. Anyway, let me tell you. <clears throat> oh yeah, uh, the tube tubs tender splash guard. Yeah. <clears throat> no, I think I've got it solved, but I'll, I've got your link and if I need them, I'll get them. I will check those out. Anyway, what else? Uh, oh, yeah, fix your Amazon link. Uh, there were some problems with it, but I think what it is, uh, I, I was using my smartphone and attaching the links, that just using the phone. And uh, for some reason, I don't think it was getting all the link. And so I'll just go back to using my Chromebook and add the, the uh, uh links later i did i did adjust two of them though because they weren't working i don't think they were working right but anyway for those of you that use the amazon link or try to use it i do appreciate it and for you new guys what it is i'm an amazon affiliate i hate to say this in every video but they're 70 percent of the viewers of this channel are view are new every day <clears throat> so for the, uh, i'm an amazon affiliate so for those of you that want to support the channel in any way if you use that link and go to amazon and buy anything it doesn't have to be the product that it's linked to you can buy anything anything you buy during that shopping session i get a microscopic uh, commission but uh it adds up and and yeah and i appreciate it so those of you that have you have used it pat yourself on the back and those of you that will use it good for you uh thank you Rhonda, for pointing that out uh, this is uh, T Boy 2004 comment call for your information. Rust of the camera shakes when you place your hand on the table. Thank you for pointing that out, or otherwise I would never have known it. It didn't do that on your on your older trailer. I want you to look good for your audience. Well, thank you. Yeah, on the other trailer I had it on the countertop, which you know it, it was very stable. But this table, even though I think it's stable, it apparently does shake when I put my hand on the table. So I won't do that. Thank you. Uh, Bill K, uh, the tub, th uh, the shower thing, a uh, couple of takes on the shower head install takers on the shower head installation. You'll be driving that road trek. Oh yeah, I hear you. I said I'd, I'd install them for eighty-seven thousand. <laughs> oh, I saw it shaking. That's my, when I do my foot. I'm doing my foot. Okay, I got it now. It says, uh, <clears throat> yeah, you're right, Bill. That's correct, Clint. On the RV, uh, the shower thing, nice to see. It's all under control. It's getting there, Clint. We're getting there. One day, how to eat an elephant, one bite at a time. Uh, Coho looks as good as one of those oxygenic shower heads. It's a good one. I have to tell you, I took a shower yesterday and for the first, used it for the first time, and I think it works very, 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 very well. I like it. It's a thousand percent better than that garbage they put in here. But you know. This is a cheap RV, okay? It was $9,750 delivered, okay? So, you know, that, uh, that's got to tell you something. It's not exactly uh, an Airstream, so to speak. But that's all right. That's what, I knew that, and I don't care. It's fine with me. Uh, I'm not complaining. Uh, this is Aaron uh, on the RV uh, shower thing. Rusty, you messed up your... I know, okay, okay, we got... You need to get the thank. Yeah, I, don't worry. I, I got it. Thank you, Aaron. Yeah, somebody else pointed it out, and I uh, corrected it. So he says, laugh out loud. Great videos, brother. Keep up the great work. Thank you, Aaron. I plan to. There, you know, what you see is what you get, guys. <clears throat> it ain't going to change. There's not going to be any glamorous introduction. There's not going to be any music in the background. <laughs> Nothing. You, this is it. We've peaked. As far as tech goes, we've peaked. You also get to see me wipe my nose every now and then. 
Grandma Patty, <clears throat> the first television I ever purchased was bought in 1974, paid $79 for it. It had a 12-inch screen and was black and white. I hear you. Well, our first one was probably, it was about 1950-something, and it was, I don't remember the brand, in the middle 50s, and it weighed about 80 pounds and had a screen about that big around. There was nothing to watch anyway. There was only programming at certain times of the day. A few, uh, two or three days a week, a few hours a day, maybe. That was in the beginning. Uh, this is Joe9209, comment call. I share your amusement as Google pauses before say, saying your name. It's almost like it has to look up your name to remember it. Well, you know, you got to know it's doing a Google search by trying to find who I am. Uh, this is Grandma Patty. Uh, this is about the shower. There's nothing like a nice hot shower on achy muscles. Boy, and I have them. I got some 72 year old muscles that have not been used in a long time and they're they're feeling the pain but we're we're about done now we'll finish up in two days <clears throat> today and tomorrow and we'll be pretty clean out there <clears throat> uh, let's see um, this is Sarah on a drive hey Rusty choose choosing the drive today thank you everyone joke about the TVs as they get larger. Love your thoughts. Letterman had a joke going a long time about how to tell your wall was too small for your TV. <laughs> I hear you, but it's just, you know, it's a lot of keeping up with the Joneses and a lot of keeping up with the technology, and that's the way we are. There's nothing wrong with that, and if it, if we didn't do it, the economy would grind to a, stall, a, a halt worldwide. This is about the shower thing. K, K. Wallace, good job, Rusty. Now you can shower without washing the floor at the same time. No kidding. When I saw that water on the floor, I almost cried. But anyway, I, I thought it was a leak at first, but it wasn't. I mean, it, it was just running down the side. <clears throat> uh, it says, I sure enjoyed traveling in my motorhome for many years, but now at 78, I have sold mine and will not replace it. So your travels will give me a view of places I never went to. Possibly. We'll see how that goes. Laser Racer 6 on the shower. I want you to fit a shower head for me. 87000 seems a bit cheap. So let's make it an even 90000 Sorry I haven't got cash, but I have a personal check. Only thing is it slipped off the table and it's bouncing so hard I can't catch it. I hear you. If I wrote a $90,000 check... Whoa, yeah, I hear you. Might have the same problem. So this is uh, a drive an intuitively one. <clears throat> Let me recommend this product. Bath rub shower splash guard at work for me. Well, thank you. I'll check that out. Yeah, both of those I'll check out because, yeah, if there's a better way to do things, I'm for it. Uh, Michael, uh, how you doing, Michael? How's your Class C working out? This is in the shower. It says, uh, I actually picked up the same shower head at Camping World. A couple of weeks ago to install tomorrow when I pick up the Class C tomorrow. I guess I made the right choice if Rusty approves. And the only reason I approved, I went to Ace Hardware, Ace Hardware and that was the only one they had. <laughs> I mean, big choice, huh? It works. I mean, it looked good and the price was okay, so I thought, hell, I'll do it. Intuitive one on the shower. <clears throat> says, if you have low flow in your shower head, just remove the aerator from inside the shower head. There are videos on YouTube showing how to do this based on your model. My house is over 120 years old with low water pressure, and this trick worked. Okay, that's good to know for you guys out there that have that problem. Uh, new coachman, mine. Phil, Rusty, congrats on the new travel trailer. Great layout for, for one in this one. Best wishes and happy travels to you. Well, you're, you're, thank you, Phil. Appreciate it. Uh, this is uh, Fleeting Days on the pickup camper. My little Lear when I was camping in it. Rusty, what type of mileage are you getting in the Dodge truck? Oh, this is, I need to correct that. I'm getting better mileage than that. Let me recorrect that right now. <clears throat> Correction, 25 MPG. Thought you meant towing and 
RV. There we go. That's better. Okay, now, congrat. This is Claire. On it says on the moving into a smaller RV. Congratulations. I like the siding. Is that aluminum? Yeah, it is. Uh, I like that it is painted and can be waxed. Yeah, you can wash it just like a car. I think. Uh, Teresa, on uh, <clears throat> comment call. Rusty, I admire your ability to keep up with new technology. I try. You are quickly becoming one of my favorite YouTube travel personalities. I just celebrated my fourth year without TV service, and I'm all the better for it. By the way, if I would have been born a boy, Mama would have named me Rusty and <laughs> stay cool, my friend. Sincerely, Tess. Well, thank you, Tess. <clears throat> yeah, if you don't keep up, I try, but I'm still behind. But, you know, if you don't keep up with technology today, man, you won't be able to go to the grocery store. Uh, Will, comment, call. I was going to hire you to clean my house, but you are too slow. <laughs> I hear you, boy. But I am. I'm, I'm supposed to be. Uh, this is on Prius car camping. Brian Burks, don't get caught drinking alcohol in your car. That's a no-no. Not in Texas, it ain't. As long as you ain't moving. <clears throat> or not in a public place. Now they'll they'll get you. Uh, comment call Sarah J. The bubble thing is fun decor with your decor with your RV minimalist and does provide beauty and function. Yeah, it works. That's all I can say. Diana left some emojis RV stuff. Uh, time zone. <clears throat> Uh, drive, uh, maybe one more future downsize, a 13-foot scamp and a Ford Ranger. I doubt that. No, I think we, well, we, I'm not going to say no, because you never know what I'm going to do. I don't even know what I'm going to do. It, and I always have, let me tell you, it's my mind, and I have the right to change it, okay? Anytime I want to. Leanne, 49, a drive in Central Texas, recovering from hernia operation, so I truly enjoyed this video. I do like it up in the hill country and this is the best time of year to ride around and you bet it is hope you find a shower head to your liking and everyone is different right correct thanks comment call aaron hey rusty are you paying rent to stay on that property or is it a piece of land that you own i own it i've owned it for 12 years so and it saved me probably five thousand dollars a year in rent yeah it's worth it uh, Rondelin 100, a drive, uh, another winner with drive time with Rusty. Get that Amazon link fixed, Rusty. I think I did. I feel a, I feel a need to order some more goodies for my new to me trailer. I'll wait till I know you're getting credit. Okay, well, yeah, I mean, I'll post it using my laptop from now on and not my phone because I think that was causing the problem because we didn't have any issues until I started posting the link using my phone. So we'll I'll stop that. This is Wayman on the shower thing. I just noticed the Amazon link also having no space between the end of link and thank you. Yeah, I, that's on the smartphone. I, I, never mind. I, I corrected it, or I will. <clears throat> shower thing, uh, Rondla 100, great vid. Rusty for us newbies, appreciate all tips, silicone, caulk, and tape. Your new shower head looks like it has great, it does, great pressure. I was going to order the Oxygenics through your Amazon link, but that Camp Co. of yours looks like it will work fine. After you fix your link, I will place another order. Thanks. Okay. Yeah, all, it should be, be the link should be working because I did correct it yesterday, but <clears throat> when I post this video, I'll be sure that I use the laptop. Uh, after you, okay. Dennis M, the shower, the on-off switch on the new shower head can be used when you are boondocking and want to conserve water. That's correct. That's what it, that shower head's all about. Fleeting days, truck camping. That's when I was in my Lear. Rusty, you are a precious veteran. Thank you for your service always. Well, I'll promise this, I wasn't John Wayne. <clears throat> a drive in Central Texas, crypto anarchy. Enjoy the ride, Rusty, like a diamond in a goat's rear. <laughs> He likes that saying, doesn't he? Yeah, I said that in the video. There was an old friend of mine who used to play golf with me, and, and he'd say that. Tom the dog. Uh, this is about the tiny home. Looks more like pine. On the inside, it is pine. I was, I stand corrected. It looked like cedar, felt like cedar, but it's pine. Old Pete. Uh, drive in Central Texas. All you can eat catfish. Yum, yum. Yeah, they have it every Friday night right down the road from me, about a mile and a half. 
uh, free blaze free you hook your you hooked up to water on your property yep water electric electric and septic full hookup right here babe uh, Virginia I do buy from Amazon on occasion and from now on I will use your link well Virginia pat yourself pat yourself on the back yo <laughs> thank you <clears throat> Wayman fixed yay that time about the shower dope boy magic the travel trailer mine cool video deaf subbed good uh, this is about my channel introduction Michalux M-I-C-A-L-U-X I took your advice and bought a lighter RV. We couldn't decide whether to go for the Shasta 21CK, which is somewhat bigger and heavier, weighing at 4,300 pounds, or the lighter 1900RD Crossfire Bullet, weighing at 3,500 pounds. You commented that the 4,300 pound would be something to tow with our smaller Nissan Frontier truck. You ain't kidding, babe. Thanks for helping us polish our stone to a diamond. Yeah, the, the the less weight you've got, the better off you are. But again, that's all related to space. You know, if you need more space, you're going to have to pull more. <clears throat> yeah, but the the less you have, the the more enjoyable your trip's going to be. That's all. I think my opinion, my opinion, mine, mine, mine. Uh, 53 Philip, tiny home, and by the time you have electric water and septic installed, uh, you're etc. In land, you're in for well over a hundred thousand. Well, it depends on where you live. You know, land prices vary. Traveling with Rick, com comment call Rusty that 9750 was the total cost, including deliver, deliver, dealer prep freight tax. Correct. That's absolutely correct. 9750 out the door. <clears throat> but I added a hitch and stuff to get it over $10,000 so I could get 1.85% financing. They wouldn't do it for under $10,000. Uh, Scott on comment call, and this will be the last one. Hey Rusty, congrats on the new home. Very cool. Are you planning on going to the RTR in Quartzsite in January? Would love to join you for Beer 30. <clears throat> I don't know about that, Scott. I may go out there, but it, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I mean, I may be pulling out of here in January and heading that direction. But, uh, you know, as far as going to the RTR and all that stuff, I doubt it. Uh, you know, the RTR is too crowded for me. Uh, you know, it's interesting and I'm, it's great and I'm glad that... Uh, what's his name does that but uh, you know it's uh, it's just too crowded for me I mean I, I like privacy and stuff so but I may go out there of course it's a neat area to camp and uh, that little pizza place downtown is packed and they've got pretty good pizza it's a little pricey but but anyway guys with that in mind this is rusty 78609 saying adios carpe diem let me get this thing off and there it is and there's my tv and laptop just closed okay and i don't have it all this crap in my house so anyway uh thumbs up carpe diem adios bye 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 usa made when you can drink plenty of water three or four three or four quarts a day will not hurt you <clears throat> it's good for you it will actually help you avoid kidney stone gouts and it'll help you lose weight that's just drinking water guys think how easy that is and uh, yeah, uh, and you feel full and you don't eat so much. So you, it helps you maintain a healthy weight. And the best way to lose weight, folks, I'll give you a simple way. Eat less. Uh, what else? Uh, take deep breaths. Breathe in through your nose. Hold it for a second and then breathe out through your mouth. Do that several times a day because that does relieve stress and that lowers your blood pressure. And lowering your blood pressure is very good for you. So at least try it. You know, those are two th those are freebies. You don't have to go to a doctor and get a prescription for that, okay? Just do those two things, and you're, you're helping yourself. And the third thing, a good one, you know, stretch. You know, stretch your arms and stretch, you know, stretch, stretch, stretch. And uh, take a walk every day. Every Not every other day, folks. Every day, every day, every day, every day, every day, every day, every day. If you, you know, you're working in an office where you, you know, just stand up. That's even, even you know, sitting down is un unhealthy. Sitting down for long periods of time is not healthy. So having said that, guys, enjoy your day. <clears throat> I'll enjoy mine. And Puff the Magic Dragon is uh, getting there. I've got some things on order to help finish it out. And I've got a few things out there. I mean, believe it or not, the patio is almost clean right now. I'll, sh I'll do a video uh, probably tomorrow or the next day about my progress. But anyway, enjoy your day. Adios, amigos. This is day five already in the new RV. Bye-bye.